Hey Sydney. Hey Mr. Hernandez. Tomorrow and Thursday, I won't be here. So I was wondering if you could sub for me since no one else is available and I trust you more than anyone else in class. Are you serious? Yes. Sure. Great, I'll leave all the assignments on my desk. And what you'll be teaching will be on the board. I'll see you on Friday. Hey Dad, Mr. Hernandez left me in charge of the class for tomorrow and Thursday. That's nice. If you need any help, you can call me. I used to be a high school geometry teacher 20 years ago. Okay, the next morning. Okay, the rest of the class isn't gonna be here for half an hour. So I can watch YouTube until they get here. 30 minutes later. Hey, I heard that Mr. Hernandez isn't here. Who's the substitute? You're looking at him. What? You're the substitute? Yeah, today's gonna be an interesting day. Do you know who the substitute is? It's Sydney. What? How is he the sub? Okay guys, who can answer this problem? Come on, don't be shy. Um... 12. Okay, let's get an answer from someone who isn't a complete retard. I think I know the answer. I think I know the answer. Shut up, fat girl. Hey. Don't call me fat, you fucking Jew. Basil. Did you just say the F word? Jew? No, he's talking about fuck. You can't say fuck in school, you fucking fat ass. Scarlet. Why the fuck not? Basil. Shut the fuck up, Basil. Lisa. Fuck all of you. Eric. Dude, you just said fuck again. Tasha. Fuck! Tyrone. What's the big deal? It doesn't hurt anyone? Fuck fuckity fuck fuck fuck. How would you like to see Dr. Lewis? How would you like to suck my ass? What did you just say? Oh, I'm sorry. What I said was, how would you like to suck my ass? Holy shit, dude. Um, what did you do now? I swore in front of the whole class. You know the rules. After school detention with Ms. Ross. Hello? Dad, this class is a nightmare. Can you come down here? I can't. I have a meeting in a few minutes. After school. How was school? Terrible. That class is out of control. You know, I'm a teacher at the elementary school. How about you stay home tomorrow and I'll deal with your class. Okay, the next day. Where's Sid? He probably got sick of us. No, he got sick of you. Hello class, my name is Mrs. Marquez and today... Oh, you're Sid's mom. You know what I think? No. What? Fuck you. Hey, watch your mouth. And you will not stick up your middle finger at me or anyone in this class. You don't run me. You know, I have a sister just like you. Doesn't want to listen. She talks back. And guess what happens to her? What? She gets arrested. She's a prostitute with a criminal record. If you keep on you'll have a record just like her. I already have one. You just want a cheap insult from me. And you just won a trip to the school counselor's office. Miss Hickman, was her name? What? I can't get in trouble again. Or I can't have a party. Ah, we're not having a party. Miss, you don't understand. My mom is letting me have a party for bringing up my history grade. If I get in trouble, she won't let me have it. I haven't even handed out my invitations. Oh, I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. By the way you're acting, you don't deserve a party. So here's an invitation to Dr. Lewis's office instead. Please, I can't go to Dr. Lewis's office. Why can't you? You've got two legs that aren't broken. And his office isn't that far from this room. It's just down the hall to your right. <laughs> okay, now with that juvenile delinquent out of the way, you would like to answer the problem on the board? Okay, you can come up here and answer the problem.